What would a strong finish mean to you? You know, August wasn't great. And you're hitting the ball really well. What would that mean to you? <clears throat> that would mean a lot. I mean, simple as that. We have been working. I came over here January 4th, um, you know, to start this progress, to this build up. And, uh, you know, I'm not gonna, I'm just not going to back down the last month. It's, uh, you know, just a lot of my thinking about what, everything I went through and just, you know, trying to finish strong for all of that. It's kind of a weird season. Not many people have the circumstance you have with surgeries, time off, and all that. What have you thought of this season so far for you? To be honest, been good. You know, I can't, I can't lie to myself. It's been good. Obviously, I can do way better. But, I mean, this is baseball. It's the hardest game of the world. And, you know, I'm just I'm just here to perform and give my, everything of myself every single day. How rewarding was it to hit a, hit a ball into the second deck like that with so many, you have so many close ones that didn't go out, but for, to crush the ball like I should do that more often then, right? <laughs> but uh, just, you know, just better swings, better at bats. Uh, every time I go out there, you know, it's, it's a little bit more of what I've missed the last almost two years. And, you know, uh, I'm just trying to to be as best as possible. Yeah, Bob had said that in your first, year, your first year back after all the surgeries, he wasn't intending to play you this much. Have you ever wanted to take a rest and just take a little break for the game or do you want to just keep, just keep, keep on going? No, um, I came. I came this year right away with one mentality: it was to play every single game that that I was able to this season, and I've been able to play every single game, and I'm going to continue to do that to the last game. You and Pedro, two guys that have been in this organization for a long time. What do you make of the ways they're throwing the ball lately? It's been amazing. It's been amazing. You know, Pedro has has been through a lot in, in the minor leagues. A, a guy has pitched his way to the big leagues and uh, you know I'm so happy for him being able to see you know the all the all the work that, that we put together in the minor leagues and he for a longer period of time and now that we're here both together in the big leagues and seeing him having success it's a it's a really beautiful hi uh, history to be part of. Does it strike you when he gets a standing ovation knowing that history that he's had like he's walking off those 40,000 people cheering his first career win? You're just happy you're you're happy you, you know when you, when you see stuff like that you definitely know the backgrounds of players and you know just being able to to see that you just cherish those moments and, and it, you know it definitely make that all the work that he put off to pay off at the end of the day these probably aren't the numbers that xander was hoping for before the season started but what's it been like just these probably aren't the numbers that xander was hoping for for himself before the season started but what's it been like just playing with him and getting to know him and he's doing some stuff on Sanders one of the best baseball players out there right now, you know, and, and probably he, he haven't had the season that he wanted, but we haven't been making adjustments since day one, and that's what good player does, and, you know, we're here for the long run, and we're here to finish strong.